All right, Chris. Go ahead and lift it. All right, I got it. It's pretty heavy. All right, All right Brian, you just kind of watch it. If it starts to tip over, Brian, tell him. All right, one down. Whoa! You gonna go sell that? Yeah, I'm gonna go sell this one. Like we've sold many of them already. I went from living a city life as a mechanic that was struggling on a day-to-day -day basis to rejoining my family to start a farm and help them get out of debt. This is Family RP. We make good money off that? Uh, 47. Wow. All right, here we go. All right, well, we got 50K for that. That's awesome. All right, I'm on my way back. Go get this last one sold. And you're gonna also uh, spin my truck out while done that. That's interesting. I was just seeing how good the tires were. Oh, is that what you were doing? Yeah, seeing how good it handled. It did pretty good too. I recovered it. I will say the construction crew should be here later because they're gonna be building us some new barns and kind of rebuilding some stuff. Alrighty. Well, only 19 bells so far, so. That's good, but I will say this, Chris, you ain't gonna be too happy. Well, I why? think what we need to do is we need to take our current sheep that we have and sell the babies and take our actual grown adults and uh, take them to the, the house. Why, are we, why do we, why? Well, because we can buy new ones that are gonna be cheaper. Sell the babies? Yeah. I think hmm. he broke his heart. I think I need to go to S-Mart real quick again. No, you don't need to go to S-Mart, come on back. Okay, I'm coming back. You'll be, you'll live, okay? It's only the babies. I mean, we're not gonna put the babies in the house. We're just gonna put the, the adult. We'll say, boys, everything's looking mighty nice. We got those over there. What do y'all uh, think about putting some more trees up over there? And we start making that tree hauling into like a business. That's a perfect idea. And it seems to be probably one of your best bets to get out of debt. I was gonna say, we could probably, I don't know, I think that silage was possibly the best bet, the other debt. I mean, the combo of the two is definitely gonna take care of things. I'm saying once we get out of this debt, we're going, can we go back to the city? No, I'm living, we're living here permanently. This is our new life. And plus, you're married, you have a wife here. Where does she want to go? Uh, I actually talked to her about that. But I say, uh, she probably wants to stay near her dad, and you are not married, and that shows how long you've been married, thinking you had a choice without talking to the wife. Why'd you get married without knowing where she wants to live long term? Hey, bro, come here. Yeah. You want to do me a favor? What? Go up to the good dealership, and they have a can of gasoline up there. Since all of our stuff runs on diesel, we need a can of gasoline to start a bonfire tonight, okay? I mean, last thing I heard from her, which was the other day, is saying she'll come back once we settle, once we figure the loan out. So hopefully we get it figured out here very soon. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She told you that? Yeah. Sounds like this is a little bit more about the money than about her mom. Hey, you quiet now. I just, do you need to talk about it? You want to talk through it? No, 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 no I don't. Get the okay. bell. Is that just, the last one? You know, it's your cousin's here for you. You mm -hmm. need to talk about it. Yeah, I need you to talk less. How about that? Hmm. Sensitive. These radios are getting terrible, boys. Y'all can quit talking about my wife like that. Thank you. Yeah, she ain't signed, She ain't giving me no papers yet, so she's still legally my wife. Have you checked and, under the doormat? Yes, yes, I have. Thank okay, you very just, much. Okay, just making sure. We got the bales all taken care of. What's next? Well, I mean, next thing would be, I mean... Chris, Chris you want to come with me? I mean, bro, don't the old dealership open back up today? Uh, yeah, they're open, but they're still kind of bringing stuff in, so... Am I supposed to wear the same shoes as you guys? I noticed there's like a uniform going on here. I got told by the old man that there would be some forester equipment down there today. Can you go down there and uh, see if you can start working so that we can get some discounts? Because we need a we need a tree planter. Her dad. Your father-in-law. Oh, that that old man. Yeah. I thought you were talking about the other old man. No, I'm talking. I'm talking about her father. I'm talking about your father-in-law, the one that I'm getting really acquainted with. That's telling me you barely work. So me and him's getting very acquainted here recently. So. I want you go to work and get me some more money, okay? Is that who you went to dinner with the other day? Yeah, it was, actually. Oh, I was wondering where you were at. Yeah, I mean, his mom met up and went out to dinner with uh, his his, his uh, father-in-law. Nice. Not your mom, she... your stepmom. When did she come back? Uh, she... Well, I asked her to come to dinner with me so that we, so we have a date night. That's why I got away from y'all. Um, yeah. She just don't like talking to you anymore. She said last time she talked to you, you were rude to her. Sorry. Was she upset that she didn't know he was married too? 
Exactly. She he was. Come on, Chris. Oh man. I'm not looking forward to this. We we gotta go buy a trailer. Um the sheep get to go to a new home. Yeah, they get to Yeah, that's Can we just uh let's just talk about it like it's um it's just like it's a crop. A summer vacation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That works. How much is it? Twenty thousand. All right. Here's a check. You want to explain what you're doing here, bud? I was just counting uh, how many uh, wheels are on this thing. Like, uh -huh. makes, there's one, two, three, four, five here. Let me guess. Your wallet's also getting really issue right now. My wallet. Mm -hmm. No. So you ain't thinking about buying this at all? I mean, I don't know what that has to do with my wallet. I usually just like take out loan. I'm. A what? What did he just say? He didn't just say what. I... No, he didn't. I just don't like what we're doing with this trailer. What are we doing with this trailer? Um, sheepies need a place to go naughty night. Mm-hmm. Right. That's what I'm sad about. It's okay, buddy. If you're gonna be this sad about it, how about this? We don't sell them, we just put them in the trailer, and hopefully they survive. Are you driving them there? No, we're just gonna leave them here, and sit. we're gonna leave them out here in the parking lot, in the trailer. Hmm. I'd rather know what happens to them, because otherwise I'm gonna go look for them, and then when I can't find them, I'll never be back. All right, they're all loaded up now. All right, just making sure you don't got any babies in there. No, all the babies right here. All right. I got a man who's coming later today to pick them all up. All the babies up? Yep. Yeah, and they're going to a different farm, right? Well, here's the thing is, actually, there's only 10 babies here, so we might just load them into the trailer and keep the babies. I like that. So, but we're going to kind of get rid of these guys. That's okay. You're in debt. You got to do what you got to do. It's part of running a farm. I don't have to like it, but I get it. Well, we're going. does it make you better? No, we're going to go to the auction later and buy some more sheep. Yeah. Can we get a we'll ram, too? Yeah. What about goats? No. This is a nice building. Yeah, it's a great building. That's not bad. We're getting a lot of money for this, right? It's not just free, right? We're not, like, donating them. I don't like that silence. I mean, they're already inside, so we might want to leave before we hear uh, yeah. shots. The shots? <laughs> you want to get in the truck? What kind of... You... Why would they use guns? Get in here. All right, Chris. You, we took the sheep to a safe place. Yeah. We'll get the money for that eventually. But I think it's time we go ahead and get the construction crew here, okay? Uh, the, well, they said, I mean, they're they're in a safe place, okay? They're, they ain't nothing going to happen to them, okay? Quink, quink. No, Judge. Oh, my goodness. This looks so nice. Is that you? Yeah, I'm back. It's good to see you back. How was your vacation? It was great. This place looks amazing. I'm glad I got to see it like this instead of the slow change. This is impressive. Ain't that the truth? Thanks for hanging out on another episode of Family RP. If you haven't already, hit that like, subscribe button, and I'll catch you on the next episode.